Hey guys, welcome back to the series of Django. As we are doing the hospital management system using the Django framework, we have done with logout for the users. In this tutorial, we are doing the profile page for the users. So let's get started. All right, I have already designed the pages for the patient user. I have a home page, profile page and make appointments and also the view appointments page. So first I need to change the view of the login. That is, I need to render the home page which I have created in Bootstrap. So for that, I'll change the template name that is patienthome.html. And I need to check whether there is an error while rendering the page. For that, I'll create a variable with name error that is equal to empty inverted commas and I'll say that if user is not none, then there will be no error that is error is equal to no. And now I'll create a dictionary here as D is equal to braces of key is error and also value will be error. And now I'll send this dictionary as the third parameter of the render function. And now in the patient home.html, I'll write this condition that is a uh, braces mod if equal error is no. That means if there is no error, just I'll redirect to the home page of the patient. So I'll open the script tag and I'll write window.location of I'll write the URL that is a uh, URL space home and end the if equal. So for that I'll say and if equal. And if there is an error, simply I'll copy this and say error is yes. And then I'll give an alert that is a uh, alert of invalid credentials and I'll redirect back to the login page. So I'll say window.location of braces mod space URL space login. But till now we did not create a function to view the patient home page that is home. So we need to create a view and also the URL for the page. Now I'll go to the views.py file and here I'll create a function that is dev space home of request. Here we have a small problem. What if the unknown user opens the URL? That means he can directly redirect to this page right with the slash home. How will we restrict him to go to this page? So for that we will write a condition that if not space request.user.is underscore active. We use this is underscore active for the users other than admin. So the condition says if you are not the user then we need to redirect him to the login page because the user is not logged in but he is trying to open the home page. So for that we will say return redirect of login page as there will be a home page for every user but we cannot create a view for every user right so for that we need to redirect them to their respective home page using their groups so for that we need to get the group name of the user who logged in for that g is equal to request.user.groups.all of so list of zero dot name this gets the user's group name and now I'll set this condition that is uh, if g is equal to patient then we will render the patient home page that is patient home dot html. So that is return space render of request comma patient home dot html. And now let's create the URL for this function. Open the urls.py file and I'll enter the path that is path of home slash comma home comma name is equal to home and now I'll add this URL to the patient home template that is I'll remove the hash and say braces mod space URL space home I have not yet created these pages I'll not change them and I'll add the logout function that is uh, remove the hash and say URL space logout so save the file and check whether it's working well.
and yes it's working good so let's go to the patient profile page so first we need to create a view for the profile page that is a dev space profile of request and here also we should have that condition that is a if not space request dot user dot is underscore active and I will redirect to the login page that is a return space redirect of login page. This statement will be common wherever you are working with the website after the user logged in. So I need to get the user group that is a g is equal to request dot user dot groups dot all of zero dot name and i'll say if g is equal to equal to patient then i need to get the patient details first so i'll say patient underscore details that is equal to i need to get the information from patient model not the user model so i'll say patient dot objects dot all of i need to get the information of the patient but for which patients we need to get so for that I need to filter the information we got from the model so I will filter with dot filter of email is equal to I am using the email to filter which is the primary key of the model and I'll say request dot user this gives the users username and we have given the username as email itself so I need to send this data to the profile page so I'll create a dictionary d is equal to braces of the key is equal to patient underscore details and also the value is patient underscore details and now I need to send this d to the template so I'll send this as the third parameter of the render function so I'll say return space render of request comma patient profile dot html comma d we have done with the view and we need to create the url so for that open the urls.py file and add the path that is a path of profile slash comma profile comma name is equal to profile so we have got the data and sent it to the page and now we need to view them in the page so for that open the patient profile.html file and now we should have a loop to iterate the data in the dictionary i'll say braces mod space for d in patient underscore details and close them and i'll close this for loop after the form completes that is a braces mod space and for the design of the profile page looks like the registration form with the only the text boxes and some labels so i need to get the data and place this value in the text boxes and the text boxes should be only read so we cannot edit the value in the text boxes so for that i have uh, an attribute called read only which should be in the input tag and uh, i should have a value attribute in the tag which should store the data which is coming from the database so for that i'll say value is equal to double braces of d dot name so this is a representation of variable in Django. So this says to view the value in the dictionary D. So this name is a variable from the model and we got that into the patient underscore details. So let me add this read only attribute for all the tags and come back. Similarly, we will give for the email also that is a value is equal to double braces space d dot email for gender value is equal to double braces of d dot gender and for phone number value is equal to d dot phone number for the address. I will not specify it as value, but I'll give in the middle of the tag that is a double braces of d dot address. And for date of birth, I'll say value is equal to double braces of d dot birth date. And for blood group last, value is equal to double braces of d dot blood group. And for all these tags, we have the attribute as read only is equal to empty inverted commas. And now add this template URL in both patient home dot html and also the patient profile dot html.
Save the files and check whether the profile page gives the details of the patient or not. And yes, it's working good. That's it for now. Hope you guys like this video. Make sure you subscribe and hit the bell icon for instant notifications from my channel. Thanks for watching.